Sorry about that. How's it flying, guys? This is Lance Corbel Hawk 30, and I'm going to do something a little different, something new that I just got. This was a Christmas present that I've only just recently uh, redeemed the code for, but this was really cool. I have not opened this yet, so you get to experience this together with me as I open this. Uh, I got something from Geek Fuel, and I've never had anything, got any of these boxes from there before, so this is going to be cool. So, where's a knife? Uh, you know what, you know, uh, <laughs> I got nail clippers. <laughs> Maybe it doesn't work. If I stab myself in that process, oops. Actually, keys. These work decently as a substitute. Substitutional box cutters, kind of. I wouldn't recommend them being your first choice, though. Yeah, there we go. See, <clears throat> see, it works just fine. All right. So, let us see what we got. They asked for a shirt size when I entered these codes, so I, there's a shirt in here. Geek Fuel. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Hey. Congratulations, instant winner. You have won $5 courtesy of Geek Fuel. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I'm going to keep that. Does it expire? Doesn't look like it. All right, so sweet. I'm going to keep this. Hey! Prime! That's cool. That is that is really cool. I wasn't expecting that. But then again, this is one of those things where they don't tell you what they're going to send you. Hello? <laughs> Super Soft Shell. But look at that. I got a Mario thing. Is there anything in here? No. No, it's not one of those pop-outs. Barrel cooler. Barrel cooler. I better sit down when I'm showing these things. Hey, unless it's to show off the shirt. Well, I already showed off the shirt, so never mind. Barrel cooler. That's awesome. A Ghostbusters... A Boo Busters button. Not a Ghostbusters, a Boo Busters. Mario. I'll take that. Ninja Stars fridge magnets. Uh, that's really cool. In case you're wondering why I keep looking this way, that's why my computer screen is there. And it's showing this, like, so I can see as we're recording how good the quality is. And it looks like really good quality. It's like, <sighs> okay, so. What is this? Ah! Oh, what's in this first? Big Trouble in Little China. Hmm, that's cool. Oh, 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 oh. Now we're getting to something that I have an interest in. Cool. Two downloadable Steam games. Um, Rats Instagive. Haven't heard of that one. Shoot first, eat cheese later, jump into a fast, frenetic, and exciting one-hit, one-kill FPS arena shooter with a totally level playing field, tons of maps, customizable, and a robust map editor. That's cool. That is very cool. And this is Poncho, which is a, a robot, a poncho, and a journey of discovery. Make your way through this wonderful world of pixelated parallax platforming to solve the ultimate question, who is Poncho? Hmm. Well, this is cool. <clears throat> Yeah, all this stuff is cool. And now I'll have to see is what's this? What is this thing right here? Well, at least it doesn't look like I have to rip it open, so that's that's nice. I'm gonna just roll it back up and shove it back in here. In the plastic. Okay, what did y'all give me?
They ain't pushing this movie. Black Panther. That actually is a really cool... Oh. <laughs> that actually is... Re that's actually pretty cool for an art design. So, yeah. First appearance was Fantastic Four, number 52, July 1966. It comes with a little bit of just the tiniest tints of trivia as to when it, when Black Panther was created and what he showed up in, created by Stan Lee and Jack Kirby. Okay, so that's really cool. That is cool. I'm gonna gonna find out. I don't know where I'm gonna put that, but you know, that's real cool. So, you know, and once I once I get a steadier source of income again, um, I might put a subscription to this Geek Fuel stuff because this is cool. Just random. Geek stuff, random stuff you can be a fan about, and if you, they they don't never tell you what they're gonna send you, and I think that is a cool aspect where you get you never know what kind of goodies you're gonna get. Uh, I think it's the same thing as uh, similar to Loot Crate, and a Loot Crate uh, always does that. So this is my first time ever making a video like this, I, I think, where I'm just no, it's not. No, it's not the first video I've ever done. Actually, it kind of is. This isn't the first unboxing type video that I've done. This is just the first video where I've had something similar to a loot box. Freaking microtransactions. <laughs> yeah, those microtransactions, right? Um, but yeah, I, I, might, I might have to do this later on once I get my own funds going again. Because this, this was a really cool, cool thing to get. Yeah, I'm gonna have to wear this Transformers Prime shirt soon. That, that is nice. That is nice. All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed watching that stuff with me. Um, I don't know if slash when I'll be able to get another one of these things, but it's really cool. It is really cool, and at least I can always put it back in the box it came in. So I don't have to worry about the storage of that, just the storage of the box. So again, this is from Geek Fuel. It's kind, it works kind of like Loot Crate, and yeah, I would recommend this. This is honestly the first. Had to move my microphone so y'all could probably hear me a little better. This is the first thing I've gotten like this, and I hope it's not the last. So, yeah. I hope you all enjoyed that little thing, and don't, I don't. I wouldn't expect another one of these soon, because again, funding. Don't currently have a job, but yeah, this was fun. Take care.